So one of the projects that I showed at AU this year was a site that came about because of the earthquakes that hit Christchurch about six years ago. Um, it's a cliff site that used to have houses on it and unfortunately most of those houses were lost in the earthquake. Um, our role in the project is to monitor that site as the site is remediated. Um, so it means a lot of material is going to be removed from that site to reshape the whole site. It soon became obvious that UAVs were going to be a pretty powerful tool in this project. Um, initially there was the use of abseilers to inspect the cliff, especially after any um, aftershocks that happened. Uh, we were able to quickly implement the use of UAVs though to, to perform those visual inspections. And the use of reality capture tools such as Recap and Remake from Autodesk um, soon became really powerful to be able to use to capture photos from the UAVs and then run those through to create models of the site. So much time saved in that process. Um, also just the accuracy, the ability to have uh, a real representation, a 3D model of that site on a weekly basis. So we can now go back over the last six months and actually see where things have changed that entire time. I've been trying to promote throughout our business uh, the use of reality capture tools on every project, not just open land type projects. Um, I see it as hugely valuable for building services um, and building structures. The ability to capture the existing buildings and have that data available to you when you're designing, but also in the construction process. So why shouldn't we be scanning buildings weekly as they're being constructed so that we know what's happened on site week to week and see where the changes have happened.